Google has built up a good reputation of enhancing its version of Android for Pixel smartphones and tablets. Every three months, the company pushes out an over-the-air update that they refer to as the quarterly platform release. This update was just recently rolled out during the month of December, and it includes a very important feature that you should enable right now. Over the years, there has been at least one software feature that I rooted my phones for. As an example, this used to be for installing TWRP as a custom recovery because it allowed for me to create full backups of my firmware, including all of the app data on the device. Developers have had an issue getting this to work with encryption, so my reason to root phones had evolved and one of the root apps that I loved was the ability to limit the charge capacity of my daily driver here. Since it's my job to create content for the Android community, I would consider myself a heavy user, clocking in four to eight hours of screen on time during most days. But charging these phones so often wears out the battery much faster than normal. And this has been exacerbated with how fast charging technology has evolved. Thankfully though, if you own a Google Pixel smartphone from 2021 or later, then you can enable a similar feature to preserve your battery for much, much longer than normal. This will work for any phone in the Pixel 6 series, Pixel 7 series, Pixel 8 series, and Pixel 9 series, and I suspect this will continue to work with the Pixel 10 series and onward. And it can be found by first launching the settings application and then scrolling down through this list so that you can tap on the battery menu. Now from here, we're gonna tap on charging optimization. This menu was previously known as adaptive charging but that has been consolidated to house both adaptive charging and a battery charge limit feature now. So after you enable the charging optimization toggle that you see here, you're then going to want to pick the limit to 80% option. And that's it. Not only will the health of your Google Pixel battery last longer, but it will also be much safer for the battery in general, since it's going to be going through much less stress than charging it up to 100% each and every day. Now, with that said, I do understand that not everyone is going to like the idea of limiting their phone to 80% battery life. The main argument that I see here is that you're basically reducing the battery capacity by 20% and you're just going to have to charge it more often. And while that is technically true in practice, it isn't as bad as many would expect, especially when you consider how easy it is to plug the phone in or set it down on a wireless charger. This feature is highly recommended for anyone who plans on keeping their phone longer than two years but even if you end up switching phones every one to two years, keeping the battery healthy during that time can increase the resale value of the phone. You'll get more money for a device with a healthy battery from marketplaces like eBay, and have also seen trade-in values plummet from worn out and damaged batteries. And this new feature also enables the phone to activate its bypass charging feature, which is great for those of you who use their phone often while it's plugged in, or those who keep the phone plugged in for extended periods of time in general. There are just too many benefits of enabling this feature to ignore it right now. So I highly recommend everyone with a recent Google Pixel smartphone to go and enable this feature right now. And there are even some non-Pixel phones that have a similar feature as well. 
like those with a Samsung Galaxy device, and recent phones from Sony as well. So please, remember to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android tips like this.